22 yards on every return. We're going to let the Kibbe Dome crowd take it from here. Bailey at the goal line. Gets to the 19-yard line, and that is where the Vandals will begin first and 10. Nathan Enderley beginning at their own 19. Enderley. into the slot all kinds of time for more complete to Austin Pettis who steps out of bound at the 39 yard line Johnson behind it that's complete and a first down to the 45 into Vandal territory goes Childs everyone going into the pass pattern here across the middle Childs Game. And they've only got eight sacks on the quarterback this season. First down for the Broncos at the 32. In motion. That's Coretta. Coretta picks up 12 yards. Set down at the 30-yard line. <laughs> 30-yard attack. Fake. Bissell. He will not get the first down. Bronco fan, it was probably a good thing you missed it. Third down and six now. Enderley on the play action. In trouble. Gets to the 20, that's three yards shy of the first down. Brought down by Dallas Dobbs, never saw that he was down there. Moore gets out of trouble again. And hits Childs for a gain of 13 and a first down. You know, yard line. Play action. Again, Childs. Knocked out at the 24-yard line. Home, growing up in Boise, this is the first opportunity he's had to live it. First and 15 for the Broncos. They can get a first down. Avery. At the five, touchdown. Jeremy Avery. That's the one thing Jeremy Avery does so well is hit the hole quickly. On the third down and eight. Pressure. Screen. Incomplete. In the whack. This is the WAC's top punt returner, Kyle Wilson. Kyle Wilson broke one at New Mexico State, looking to do it here. With a lane. Wilson. To the 40. It's a foot race. with a touchdown no flags on the field and the Broncos have taken the lead here at the Kibbe Dome second and six Enderley again wide open that's Maurice Shaw who has another vandal first down from Anchorage here's Amancio on for the field goal and it is good and set for the Broncos. Moore across the middle. Tommy Gallarda. He picks up 12 on the season, 2 of 4. He's got plenty of leg. And it's no good. First and 10. Again, Enderley on the play action. Wants to go deep. And Kyle Wilson comes up with the interception. For the junior from Piscataway. Uh, initially, great play action, but look at the hit. Enderley takes it at the end of the play from Joe Bozikovic. Avery. As his scout team was running all week long. Bissell, pitch back. Harper knocked out of bounds after a pickup 
of seven right. yards. Austin Pettis split out to the right side. Kellen Moore tucks it. Gets across the 50 and a first down to the 49 yard line. Deaver to the left side. Pitch to Avery. Has the first down and more. Avery across the 30 to the 27 yard line. Second and 11 now for the Broncos. Avery. Huge hole. Down to the 11 yard line. This Bratzman attempt. This is ball spotted at the 12. It'll be a 22 yard attempt. Down, the kick is up. And it is good. Ball is at the 28. Nathan Enderley, who has had a nice game up to this point, is sacked. 71 score, yard scoring strike. Enderley, play action. In trouble. And again, he's sacked. This time, Sean Bingham in on the stop and, and sprints out. Wants Pettis. Pettis at the 40, steps out at the 39-yard line. Vandals blitzing. Across the middle is Pettis. Shy of the first down marker by maybe a half a yard. Good snap, good hold. Second down, Childs. Big in the state of Idaho. It's pretty amazing too how many of them stay in the Treasure Valley after graduating to Boise State. Avery Excellent. bounces it outside across the 50. Still on the speed is Jeremy Avery. Foot race. He's in. Touchdown, no Jeremy play. Avery. No play. 57 yards. First and 10 at the 43. Play action. Hit and sacked Powers with the sack. Ellis Powers came in and has the football. This is a live play. Powers is going to walk in. There's no to start the second half at his own 10 now. And that's Avery who's having a breakout game. Avery. Across the 30 to the 31-yard line goes Jeremy Avery again. And down in nine now at the Broncos 32. Play action this time to Avery. And that's complete. Pettis has the first down and knocked out at the 42-yard line. He's at the 43-yard line. Avery up the middle with a huge hole. And that's another pickup of 13 for Jeremy Avery. You love to have a microphone on Coach Choke. DJ Harper. Harper across the 25, down to the 24 yard line. Fake Fake to Johnson, end around to Peretta. Peretta with a block from Brackle. Peretta. Touchdown. The ball at the 18 yard line for the Bandits. In trouble, sacked. How about that? Well, Enderley in trouble again and just throws it away. Tried not to take the sack. Billy Wynn was all over him yeah. and throws it. The attendance contest from the Idaho Lottery. Broncos are done with a gypsy doodle. That's Vinny Peretta. At midfield into Vandal territory on the double reverse to Peretta. 17,000 even and wins a $100 lotto gift pack. For more information on the Lucky Lottery Attendance Contest, go to Price Center at ZIdaho.com and be sure to enter for the next round. Look at Vinny Peretta. I, I don't know. Don't rule it out. Harper. And Harper. He won't go down.
back after this stretch and in the postseason. 300 pounder out of British Columbia, Moore. The Pettis out at the one. Pettis getting a two yard line. Two yard line. Ian Johnson is in the backfield and the ball. And he's in for the touchdown. Ian Johnson. After a very quiet day, Ian Johnson with his 54th career rushing touchdown. And second down and five. Keith McGowan with the pick. And how about the sophomore coming up big there in his... He seldom used Keith McGowan. 1,500 of them here today. Third and goal. Fumble, fumble. Vandals have it. Coach Rob Hickey says, let's, let's make this respectable, guys. And the Broncos come. Again in the end zone. Not first time I can remember. That's what I thought. Got DJ Harper in there getting the first down and getting hit hard. But that is going to do it. DJ Harper gets up slowly, but he does get up. is uh, not wound yet. Still eight seconds left to go. Well, they've got to move the chains. And then they'll wind it after they move the chains. But both fields, both sides are on the field, as you can see. And uh, the entire Bronco bench going out to midfield to shake hands. Unfortunately, it's not entirely that case on the other side of the field, but most of the Vandals 